I'm Chris Oliver, I'm Head of Engineering at Western Arts College. Within engineering we have uh, some fabulous equipment, we have um, conventional machining, CNC machining, but we're also becoming a specialist area at the minute for automation robotics. We have partnered recently with a company called ABB, who are the UK's number one automation and robotics company. We've also got a really good partnership with Haas Automation. Currently we're looking at doing something between as a collaboration between Haas and ABB where we're going to have a collaborative robot uh, with a CNC machine so we can do automated machining. Recently we have spent just shy of a million pound on new equipment within the facility um, and that was with Haas, ABB, Festo to the names from the leading suppliers we work with and currently we're looking at spending more money that we've been granted to develop automation and robotics but to take it out on the road. This will allow us to be able to outreach further and allow students and potential students to be able to enhance their knowledge and skills with regards to engineering. If I was to explain to someone why they should do engineering, it's fun, it's engaging, no day is the same, especially in, in college, it's never the same every day, but it just is very rewarding to be able to see you manufacture or create something from something that you've thought of and it's that development that I think is really exciting. So for me, engineering is an exciting place to be and really fun to be in. Uh, my name's Max G and I've, I'm currently studying level three manufacturing engineering at West Knotts College. I picked this course because during GCSEs I was like really interested in maths, but I wanted to like get out of the classroom. So I've picked engineering because it involves maths and other subjects and it's like more practical and you study like more real life problems and more real life like objects and stuff, it's like quite a few mechanical and technical drawings you study. After this course I'd like to be able to try and get an apprenticeship in some form of engineering because on this course you study mechanical and electrical so it's quite a broad scheme. I've picked a, like a BTEC more than a, because it's coursework and it's more like thinking than just on spot. It's like coursework you can do it over two or three weeks and it's not just like loads of pressure like combined into one. We do like further maths, it's higher. It's not A levels, but it's what you, it's like engineering scenarios in maths. So a lot of like simultaneous equations and rearranging, and there's mechanical and electrical principles, which is just learning like at minute just the basics when we just started. There's also a lot of like CAD work, and we do that in learning companies. CAD to design different projects for different like repairing parts and different just objects. And we also do something called comms, where it's a lot of just technical drawings and learning how to do them technical drawings online in 3D projects. Hello, my name is Stuart Parker. I'm doing a level three advanced mechanical and electrical engineering at West Knotts College. And right now today I'm going to talk about learning companies, which is it's a thing of how we're going to learn to actually apply knowledge well in the, like an actual company situation so say we've got a tensile tester downstairs we're going to use that to test different tensile strengths of different materials so we can take that and use it for our different projects and anything like that but just say anything really just anyone that comes in asks for that oh this to be made that to be made of whatever material say you steel or I mean, plastic or anything like that yeah it's more like replacement parts really on that or you can, you can get like say little orders i know last year they did this thing where you get like you know fridge magnets and stuff the ones just like some of them for the main campus i think it's better for like, you learn a bit of money with it but it's also mainly just about actually learning some actual real life application for like, the skills we're learning and stuff 